Okay. Uh, last week, Lewis, I talked about me, uh, getting on Instagram at the request of so many of our viewers, people wanting behind the scenes stuff and pictures, things related to the David Pakman show. I did that and people are just up in arms, Lewis. They're just loving it so much that there was a suggestion that each week uh, I show something from my Instagram feed to the audience. So for people who are watching with us today, this is the most liked picture from my Instagram feed from the last week. It's a picture of Lewis with a guy who looks suspiciously like the singer Rod Stewart, but actually isn't. This is from a bar that Lewis frequents that I, that I was uh, brought to, invited to by Lewis over the weekend. And indeed, this guy not only looks like Rod Stewart, kind of a Boston version of Rod Stewart, but he actually, isn't he a former or current Rod Stewart impersonator, Lewis? Well, I don't know a lot about this guy, but yeah. from what I gathered at the bar, people call him Southie Rod Stewart because right. he hangs out in South Boston. Yeah. And when they put Rod Stewart on the radio, he goes nuts and starts dancing. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And I guess he's just kind of a Boston non-professional Rod Stewart impersonator. So maybe by impersonator, we mean when he's out socially and he hears Rod Stewart songs, he likes it. Yeah, I think that's it. And people take pictures with him and that, that's pretty much it. So this is the most liked picture from my Instagram feed from the last week. You can, of course, find me on Instagram at david.pacman. And if you're if you're only listening with us today, either on the radio or on Progressive Voices or on iHeartRadio or on Stitcher or on iTunes or the podcast or any of the audio only platforms that we're on, uh, check out the picture on my Instagram feed at david.pacman. Yesterday, Lewis, people completely rioting in the streets because I put up a great short video of me making coffee with my new espresso machine. And it was just pe people were, were out of control because they were worried that the crema on my exp espresso was was not up to par. And uh, that that's something else that happened on Instagram yesterday. Mm -hmm. I didn't see that one, but I have watched you do that in person. And it's it's you've uh, expressed quite... concerns about my crema as well. I have. Yeah. It was uh, you, you hadn't honed your skills yet with the espresso machine. Right. And so it's a work in progress.